I am an artist of the musical and visual kind and I grew up in a Christian home. Uh, to say that I didn't enjoy the whole church thing would be an understatement. I deliberately removed myself from all things church and at the time I was pursuing music so I did that with like all of me. Somewhere around 2015 I went for a music internship and came back really gung-ho about music and I decided to learn how to play the trumpet. As a vocalist, playing the trumpet and teaching music and performing, I wasn't doing justice to my voice and I didn't see it coming but I lost my voice. When I regained my voice it was so painful and I had to go through therapy and stuff. That was the beginning of like a downward spiral. I uh, finally decided I had to go to a psychiatrist, so I did, made an appointment and she was quick to diagnose and she said, this is a classic case of clinical depression, these are the medicines you have to take. So I decided, okay, I'm going to take the meds. So I got on the meds and I got better, it enabled me to function day to day. So I left, I went to Gokarna, I lived there and I was like working as a freelance illustrator designer. I came back, found a job found a house and uh, I started dating someone and the first time I m my parents met him, they invited him to church and that's how I came to APC for the first time. And I would come but I would sit outside under the tree. But um, earlier this year, Benny Prasad was preaching and he said, what's your excuse for not sharing the gospel? I asked myself what my excuse was for not believing the gospel. So I said, I'll rededicate my life to Christ, what do I have to lose? And um, from then on, it's really been an upward journey because I told God that I don't want to take the meds anymore, I want to be able to function without it. And um, this was on 14th Feb and I haven't taken them since, which is pretty amazing because I couldn't function without them otherwise. I wanted Vishal to know some of the peace that I was experiencing, so I would pray. I would pray for him to be saved. And I said, 2018, he's going to be saved. But in July, Vishal accepted Christ. And it was crazy. I, I was really like, whoa, like God's like listening to me. And then I quit smoking. From then on, I've just had so many answers to prayer. And not just in my life, but in the lives of people around me. People are like, whoa, you're you're not smoking, I mean, you're going to church. And I realized my whole year has just been restoration in every space. And I've just seen myself go back to just wholesomeness. This year has been a year of restoration in so many ways, so many ways.